I believe the ancestors got a really powerful message tonight and it may tick off a lot of people. So you may want to watch this before you come on to this one. Okay. There was a lot that was stated and a lot of stuff that can trigger people. But if you watch this and then you come to this, then you'll know what I'm talking about. So I'm going to get into it. So I was watching the terror reading, right? And then all of a sudden this song came on out of nowhere. So this is saying that right before your eyes witness, yeah, witness the travesty the perpetrators of the crime are simply walking away so uh that is a problem that means the perpetrators are walking away meaning these people think they have no consequences and the justice system is falling and people are being in denial people are being puppets on a string and lies will never wash them away. So, like I said, the perpetrators are, like, pretty much telling on themselves. They're pretty much trying to put the blame on everybody else. And they're being in denial of knowing what witnesses have seen. Like I said, people were confronted. There were answers that were found. And, um, people who are needing justice, pretty much, it's falling. Defenders of justice keeps falling, so the ancestors are not too happy right now. That they are letting people walk away with what they are doing. And the patterns... Of what is being known. Witnesses means. They saw something. They knew something. They confronted. And like I said in the last reading. People got answers. And this is going to turn out to be pretty violent. So it really wouldn't shock me. If people didn't take the law into their own hands. Because the justice system is not doing nothing. For anybody. Who is going through a pattern in their life. And predators are literally simply walking away. That's what the ancestors are not going to fucking tolerate. If the law can't do anything, then you're going to have the ancestors who are going to step in and do something about it. Alright? They can't distract us from all that's appealing again and again. So that means people cannot distract of what people knows to be truth. There needs to be justice done. But uh, they cannot distract people. They cannot silence people. So pretty much from letting predators walk away. Without no consequences, they cannot distract us from all that's appealing. Are you blind? Are you cold? So, meaning the ancestors are saying people are so fucking blinded. Are you cold hearted? That you can't speak up and do something about it. So, that means people are fucking blinded. To what maybe you've been talking about. This is about criminal activity. This is about a pattern. That pretty much. The perpetrators were trying to do stuff. To distract you. They can't do it anymore. And people that are appealing. To get the justice. People. Who are. Literally. Like, there's people so fucking blinded. They can literally see it right before their eyes. Literally, they can see it. They hear it. There's even witnesses. Confirmation. 
to criminal activity that's been going on. They're letting people walk away and the ancestors go, I don't fucking think so. So the ancestors are stepping in, calling everybody out for whoever is blind. This is not a very pleasant message. This is for people who are letting shitty people get away with shit. Letting the perpetrators get away with crime or criminal activity. Letting them walk away with no nothing. But you got others who are not blind. You got others who are not cold. Always remember that. People who are blind is the fact that they don't give a shit. They don't care. But they better start caring. Because the ancestors are making it clear tonight. Stuff will be put to a stop. And these predators will have to deal with judgment on their heads for not helping people who needs it. Alright. Yeah, nothing worth believing. Yeah, so it's getting to a point to where people are saying that pretty much trying to silence you, trying to silence your voice, is that they think you don't have a right to have an opinion that there's nothing worth to believing in. Meaning that those predators who are doing criminal activity, who thinks they're walking away scot-free, they're not free. They got judgment upon their heads. And then... There's people out here stating, well, I have an opinion, oh, there is always a reason and their lies aren't worth believing. We have to show we're not giving in no more. So, that's where it is. You got people out here that's not giving in to the fucking blinded. People who are ignorant right now. People who don't know their fucking facts. When spirit gives a message, like I said, this is not going to be pleasant. This is spirit calling out every person who is being ignorant right now. Who don't know what's going on because they're blinded as fuck. They are letting people get away with shit. That's the problem. So, for people like us, like these people... Like those people that are the predators. That they have an opinion. But there's nothing left worth believing in. So they have, they have no belief. They're unbelievers. And then people like us down here. Well I have an opinion. Oh that there's always a reason. And their lies aren't worth believing. We have to show we're not giving in no more. That's what ancestors are saying. We're not giving up. We're not giving in. We are showing we're not giving in no more. So the ancestors just pretty much stated people have fucked around and found out that people who are standing in for the right are not giving in, not giving up. We're not giving in to what we know, what we stand by. And I know what my ancestors picked up on too. So, pretty much, the wicked can't disguise their motives anymore. That's exactly it. For the people who are blind, for people who do not understand what you are being told by spirit. Like I said, spirit's giving out a very strong message tonight. And it's not very pleasant for most people. Who are unbelievers? Who are questioning what your ancestors have told you. People who are trying to give an opinion. Pretty much the ancestors said shut the fuck up. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. You're fucking blind. Shut up. Before you get embarrassed. They're making that clear. Tonight. That the wicked cannot disguise their motives any way. So that means they cannot hide what is going on. They cannot hide the criminal activity. 
They cannot let these people keep walking away from what they're doing. It's the ultimate crime when we look the other way. Exactly. Spirit is saying, okay, and God is saying too, okay, you want to let somebody go through something? You want you want to turn the blind eye and want to look the other way? Okay. God said, game on. God said, okay, the ancestors got your number. The ancestors are done playing with people who are ignorant, stupid at this time. And it's also really sad, too, that the devil keeps hurting people, and they're allowing the devil to keep hurting people like they don't want to speak the fuck up. You cannot justify your perfect apathy. Cast aside your differences. Yeah, differences. Throw it away. And hear the voices of the innocents calling. There are innocents calling out for help. And they get ignored. It's pretty much what the fuck's going on. Innocence of people... Like I said, you would have to listen to the first one to understand this one right here. There are people's voices of innocence that are calling for justice to stop the criminal activity. To stop these people. To give some type of justice. To give some type of clarity. To stop what people are doing. But no, people want to sit there and call you names. They don't want to fucking understand you. Well, guess what? You are hurting innocents out there. From what your spirit, like from what I am getting. Like I said, this is going to be harsh. Because spirit is calling out dumb fucks. The ancestors are calling out people who are dummies. Dumb as fuck. Who don't know what the fuck they're talking about. For people who wants to hurt you. And letting dumb motherfuckers walk away without no fucking consequences. Those are the ones who are going to be dealt with. Of letting innocents. Are being literally. There are people who are literally. There are people voicing out. That. The innocents are getting hurt. And others are turning a blind eye. The ancestor says, okay, I got you. Okay, you want to sit there and judge a person? You want to sit there and be fucked up like the devil? The ancestor's going to fuck you up. For letting criminal activities and letting people go scot-free when they should get their asses chewed out. That's why... In the first one, it said, it's going to be a really nasty, nasty disturbance. There's going to be people starting to take the law into their own hands. That's what God and the ancestors are going to allow. Because the law won't do a fucking thing. It's time for people to be shown to stop fucking with innocence. It's time to show motherfuckers what the fuck's up. Spirit is about that life. Spirit is a gangster. You test somebody's gangster, that's your own consequences. You let people do what they do and actually want to judge someone because they didn't have enough proof in time to know what was going on. Okay, Spirit says, okay, they got your number. Spirit's not playing. This is a very, very frustrated ancestors like they are fucking done they're done with dumb fucks they're done with people who are so fucking ignorant and so fucking blind who don't know their fucking facts and they don't give a shit if you're an empath or not if you can see past present and future events you are the masters you got the keys they don't so, pretty much the ancestors told them that they need to shut the fuck up and leave you alone. Because the ancestors knows what you've been through. God knows it. They don't. They don't know the truth. Because they let fucking criminals get away with their shit. They let people hurt you. 
They do. And you know what? That's actually going to happen to them right back. And it's a full moon. Not very smart on people's actions right now. You know what I mean? I just, I just know the ancestors are saying, Are you blind? Don't you know? How can you say? Exactly. So that's what it is. The ancestors are saying people are so fucking blind. Like, don't you know anything? Are you stupid? Are you being fucking ignorant? How can you say what the fuck your opinion when you don't know jack shit? The ancestors said shut the fuck up before you embarrass your motherfucking self. It's pretty much what the fuck the ancestors are stating. Oh, you've got to fight for it. Don't let the ones decide how we defend ourselves. Thank you. Exactly. Nobody has the motherfucking right to come in and tell you how. How we are going to defend ourselves. And you profess to know that ignorance is bliss. Now, do you want to let them decide whether we live or die? Exactly. That's why the ancestors are pissed off like a motherfucker tonight. Because somebody or people don't fucking understand... That people are deciding if you live or you fucking die. That's criminal activity. People are deciding they're not fucking God. That's why the ancestors are getting fucking heated. Actually, most ancestors are not helping the dumb fucks right now. They're not. They're going to let them deal with their dumb ass shit. They want to sit there and say, well, I don't give a fuck that you got raped. I don't give a fuck that a woman abused you. Okay, God's got your number. Remember that. Don't fucking play with me. Don't fuck with me or my fucking with my ancestors. Do not fuck with what my ancestors tell me. Because you're questioning them and you're questioning God. They all got your numbers. The ancestors will not help anybody. Who is pretty much letting people who wants to unlive you or that wants to fucking kill you? They are letting people get the fucking way with it. They're letting people fucking walk. This is why the ancestors are pissed. This is a very strong message tonight. This is probably going to piss off a lot of people tonight. You think I give a damn? No. Because I know God and my ancestors don't fucking play. And guess what? Truth of a tongue fucking hurts. This is going to make people so fucking mad. Because you have a sharp tongue. Queen of Swords. You're speaking the truth. You are being cutthroat. That's what they're not going to be able to handle. Your ancestors are cutthroat as fuck. Tonight. They're cutting out the bullshit. Because it's in the energy flow. It's time to let motherfuckers know... Who the hell you are. It's time to let motherfuckers know. They better start leaving you the fuck alone. Stop questioning what your ancestors are telling you. Stop trying to confuse. What you know about. Yep. Because they can't. They can't let go. Because they got judgment on their asses. That's twice. Judgment has came out. These people. Are gonna like really freak out. Like something is literally gonna stick. In their fucking head. How cutthroats you are. They're not gonna be able to let go. That you are calling upon justice. Your ancestors and God is calling. Upon justice. Because people fucking deserve it. They cannot handle your sharp tongue. Your sharp mind. They can't handle you. Cutting motherfuckers off. Who tries to tell you differently. From what your ancestors are saying. This is communication. Once this communication gets out. Motherfuckers won't be able to let go. Like they're going to be stuck. Like in a mental state. Because they have judgment upon their heads. There's a judgment call. Like the whistleblower. Is being whistled. 
God and the ancestors are not playing tonight. They don't give a fuck if they hurt your feelings or not. People are going to fucking learn to stay in your motherfucking place and you're going to stay in your fucking lane. You're going to stop letting people try to hurt or kill someone, trying to control somebody, or how to tell them how they should defend themselves or not. That's what I'm saying, though. God and your ancestors got your battle, but people are trying to stop you from standing up for yourself. Trying to confuse you. The ancestors are coming in strong tonight. They're actually, they're heated. Very, very heated. They ain't too happy. That's why there's a judgment on their head. And whatever, Ace of Wands, whatever they were trying to do, it's not coming to them. They're not having a new beginning. They're not having a new nothing. That judgment is not coming their way. Because they're going to be stuck in what you said. They're going to be haunted. And this judgment is going to make it to where they were wanting to have something. They're not going to be able to get it. They literally thought by being sharp-tongued with you, letting people get away with it, letting people slide with certain shit. This is getting on the energy flow. That people are messing with you, will not let you go. There is a judgment call, and they're not getting a new beginning. And they're going to have burdens because people do have awareness. Deers represent having awareness now people are going to be having fucking burdens because it was seen with the third eye and then we got the five of cups so we got queen of swords eight of wands four of pentacles judgment ace of wands ten of wands ace of cups five of cups they're going to be in regret because your third eye is seeing shit that they fucking can't they're going to be in regret after today, after tonight, once this message gets out. Because they know you are very known in a public eye. You, they know of you, you're not the one to be fucked with. You're not the one to be screwed with. Because you are calling judgment. That's bringing down the tower. Because they were trying to mess with your wheel of fortune at that too. They were trying to mess with you. Your inheritance trying to mess with you. Karma is justice. That's what judgment's about. You got about three times. Because people were trying to make you feel like you couldn't go on anymore. There's going to be ex-friends, ex-lovers, people that you used to know are going to be in regret. Because their secrets came out. Because you went into hermit mode. And... The tower came because you were offered cup of intuition to let you know that your situation will be better. Cup of intuition. I say goddess of the moon is coming out here. A very motherly figure. Shit that happened in the dark is coming to the light. Situation is going to look better because they had hands out wanting to hurt you. And they let people get away with it. Now they're stuck in torment. They are around. Let me see. Yeah. Queen of Cups. Let me see. Queen of Swords. Eight of Wands. Four of Pentacles. Judgment. Ace of Wands. Ten of Wands. Ace of Cups. Five of Cups. Six of Wands. Justice. The Tower. Wheel of Fortune. Nine of Wands. Six of Cups. The Moon. The Hermit. Queen of Cups. Temperance. Six of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords. Somebody's going to end up be going to jail. Or they're going to be so much imprisoned by what you're saying. Somebody's not going to be able to handle this. That's going to put them at the crossroad because they were being the devil's fucking puppet on a string. Being the devil's bitch. Because they were juggling. They were juggling 
of how you were going to live. Pretty much somebody was trying to tell you how you should protect yourself and how you shouldn't. You shouldn't have done that. If your ancestors are telling you to stand your fucking ground, you stand your ground. You know what you know. Nobody should be coming and telling you how to fucking live. This is going to piss off a lot of people tonight. I do not give a fuck. There's a lot of involvements. When I was listening to that terror video, this came on. That song. That would explain a lot. This is going to put people in a weird state of mind. Now, there's people going to be looking at the backstab and the betrayals. What they caused you. Because you are a loving person. And a law figure knows people were fucking foolish. To be coming at you. Like they did. They're a fucking fool. They're a fucking idiot. They were foolish. Now that a cop figures in the mix. So a cop has been seeing this. Hmm. Well gee. And then you got the king of cups. Now you got a fucking father figure. You got a father figure. A uncle. Somebody. You got, you got some type of a father figure who's got you. Okay? Somebody thought they were being foolish. Somebody thought they were the shit. Somebody thought that, oh, they can do whatever. No, 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 no. No. This is ancestors saying that there's too many secrets, too many involvements, too many betrayals, too many bullshit. That it's time for you to be sharp-tongued. And piss off if they don't like it. It's facts. They get the fuck over it. Because they were being the devil's little bitch. It's what it is. So like I said. This was seen with the third eye. This was seen as a witness in the spiritual realm. The spiritual realm saw the truth. There was witnesses who knew what was going on. And it led to having justice and bringing the tower down. They were trying to weaken you. They were trying to get it to where you would not stand up for yourself. Your ancestors told you the truth that was going on in the dark. And pretty much nobody has the right to tell you differently either at this time so that's why there's justice that's why people are in regret people are at a crossroads don't know what to do because they handed their hand out to try to make you feel in a certain way but they were being the devil's bitch they were juggling and they fucked around and found out that they just pretty much betrayed themselves backstabbed themselves because you are a loving, caring person. A law figure knows what the fuck's going on. They're not stupid. You put dots together. They watch your shit. Even the FBI. A private investigator. Fucking police watches your shit. You put the pieces together. And they connected the dots. And the law figure knows the people ain't that fucking smart who goes up against you. They know you got spiritual gifts. They know you've been fucking accurate. They're not dumb. And they know about the involvement of people putting a hand out. They fucking know that shit. So, yeah. That's pretty much the message for this one. And I heard a really loud thump or a knock. So, that's confirmation. I'm gonna go in and leave this here. But, uh, yeah. People have fucked around and found out. Spirit's not playing tonight. Spirit is putting their motherfucking foot down. And going to start going to start helping people. Because the law is starting to fall on their asses. It can't fucking do a damn thing. And God is putting his foot down to a lot of shit as well. You do not piss off ancestors. You do not try to question what somebody is being told by their ancestors. That's also why they're getting karma. You do not try to confuse somebody. You do not try to come in and try to tell them differently what they know. You do not try to tell somebody how to stick up for themselves. You do not question the ancestors. You do not question God. 
everything happens for a reason. And apparently, from what I'm seeing, a lot of people fucked around and found out they should have left a fire sign alone in their sleep. And I'm getting very sick and tired of picking up on that too. But I guess apparently, I guess people are going to have to keep hearing it until somebody gets it through their fucking head. That's the truth. My ancestors keep picking up on this. Even God is picking up on this. I'm kind of getting tired of picking it up in a different time, in a different reading. It's because, guess what? It's an innocent voice who they're trying to silence. Stuff like that. So that's all it is. Innocence calling out again and again. So I guess pretty much when people start opening their fucking minds to stop being blinded. Don't you know? Meaning they don't know shit. They don't know anything. They don't. How can you say that? So pretty much the ancestors really are questioning. How can a person say that, well, you said a different story. Well, I didn't have enough proof to know everything. So that's pretty much the ancestors saying, how can you say that? Don't, don't you know anything? Are you even intelligent? Are you being a dumb fuck right now? Do you even have any fucking intelligence? But why are you being the devil's bitch? The ancestors are done playing. Like, the ancestors are not being nice right now about this type of situation. This is going to bring a lot of problems. This is going to bring a lot of anger issues. There has been communication of a lot of things. A lot of people have been doing shit on a full moon to me. And others. It's not just me dealing with this. Just like I said. It was seen with the third eye. People have been doing moon magic. The whole entire fucking time. There was a match. Match magic been done to my ass. And I had a fucking picture of it. Somebody literally had to eat a match. To get it in my fucking body. No. No. You gave motherfucking burdens to yourselves. That's why there's karma. There's going to be justice. If the law cannot give you justice, I bet you your ancestors will. The spiritual realm will. There will be some type of justice. And keep stealing. And also, people looking the other way too is a problem. At that too. People are looking the other way. Okay. God and the ancestors said. Okay. You want to look away. From what a person is going through. Okay. I got your number. Okay. I remember that. So that's pretty much what it is. They're tired of seeing innocent people speaking out. But their voices are not being heard. Because people are fucking blind. They're like, seriously, don't you know what's going on? Why a person keeps talking what they're talking about? Because there could be something serious. Like, don't you know anything? Are you even fucking intelligent? What the fuck is wrong with you? That's what pretty much the ancestors are pretty fed up about. And people are being the devil's bitches. And do not tell somebody... How they should stand up for themselves. Because that is not somebody's job to say whether we should be alive or dead. That is a fucking problem. That is a organization thing. That is a gang stalking thing. That is a RICO crime thing. You know what I mean? That's where the problem is. So pretty much we're fighting for our fucking lives while people are being dumb as fuck. Don't know how to open their third eye. Who is giving opinions that don't mean shit? It's pretty much from what I'm understanding. Pretty much their opinion don't mean shit. At this time. Like I said. 
they do not have nothing left worth to believe in because they don't and they never will ultimate crime we look the other way so this is saying this is why there's cutthroat energy being put out in the universe you are being told to stand firm and what you believe in and what you know what your ancestors have told you what you feel that do not worry about what a motherfucker says to you or a motherfucker bitch says to you because they were not you in that position they only know by what the fuck they want to go by the ancestors said they could shut the fuck up and leave you the fuck alone the ancestors are heated right now very heated at this time and their wicked can't disguise their motives anyway so meaning there are people who are seeing wicked behaviors criminal activity patterns that's been going on but people are looking the other fucking way okay spirit and god said okay i got your number on that too okay i'll remember that you want to look away from someone who got treated like shit okay i bet you what goes around comes back around. Karma's a bitch. I'll tell you that. And we are not giving in no more. Meaning we are speaking. We are going to speak up. We are going to be cutthroat. We are going to start cutting motherfuckers off. We're going to start cutting people with our tongues, with our voices. We're not giving in. You're not going to be able to make us back the fuck down. Because they're unbelievers. And they don't believe in nothing anymore. They're unbelievers. They will be dealt with. Those are the type of worst people God hates. As unbelievers. They do not believe in anything. They're unbelievers. I promise you, they will be dealt with. Okay? Okay? And God and the ancestors are giving us the strength. Us the strength. We are not giving in no more. Meaning if we're going to speak, we're going to speak. Our ancestors and God is telling us to speak up about certain situations. Because you're helping yourself. Because we got people out there that don't give a fuck. Who don't really understand the definition what it does to an individual. Those people are told shut the fuck up. By the ancestors. Because they're idiots. They don't know nothing. They're one sided. They don't look at different scenarios. They're ignorant. And that's the thing though. That is the main problem. These stupid motherfuckers. Who are blinded. Are letting the perpetrators go scot-free. Letting them walk in the fuck away. Most people don't believe in that anymore. And the ancestors don't approve of that. Because that is injustice. In the ancestors realm. That is unjustified. That is injustice treatment. That these perpetrators will be fucking dealt with. They will be dealt with. And people who needs to be heard will be heard by God and the ancestors, whether people like it or not. Right before your eyes and people want to turn the blind eye, okay, God said, okay, I'll remember that. I'll remember that you get into something, okay, then, you know, God has a very funny way of dealing with people like that, kind of like a mindset Oh yeah, I've seen it. <laughs> and it's actually pretty funny. But it's karma. Because most people who turn their backs on you. Is because they are a enemy themselves. Because they don't give a damn about you. All they care about is themselves. They don't give a shit. What a person done to you. God said, okay, I'll remember that. God and the ancestors got your number. Karma's a bitch. But this is why I said this is not going to be a very pleasant message tonight. This is a very strong message. This is calling out people who are doing criminal activity. Who are the perpetrators? 
you're not walking away much longer from nothing. You will have consequences and you will get karma. You're not getting away from anybody from what you're doing. I promise you that. Trust and believe that. God and the ancestors sees everything and knows everything. Trust and believe that. But uh, this is all I got. And I hope you guys have a good night. But I'm just letting you know. The ancestors are pretty heated. And this is a pretty strong message. That people might be triggered or might get mad. Well get the fuck over it. This is how the ancestors feel. They're getting very sick and tired. Of seeing innocent people going through fucked up treatment. Because another individual is fucking blinded as a fucking bat. But uh. This is all I got. Like I said, to understand this, you may have to go to the first one. But this is all I got. You guys will get justice. But the perpetrators for the people who are turning their back and saying that they don't give a fuck anymore, trust me, they're going to be dealt with. The unbelievers are going to be dealt with harshly in time. Just like I said, I'm going to go and get off of here. But there is judgment three times. From the first one and from here. That's three so far. But this is all I got. I hope you guys have a nice day. Stay strong. Trust your intuition. Stay strong. And always stand your ground. I love you guys. Always protect yourself. If you have to speak, speak. Do not let nobody silence you. And have a good day, guys.